So what exactly is brainwave music? Well, it's really a catchphrase that describes the two kinds of sounds that are typically embedded in the kinds of programs we have on our YouTube channel, such as hypnosis, deep sleep, meditation and relaxation, and the study programs that are so popular. Now, the two kinds of sounds are known respectively as binaural beats, number one, and number two, isochronic tones. And what each of these sounds does is guide the brain into the respective categories that we talked about in the first video. That is, you can either feel sleepy or in a deep meditation or very relaxed or very alert. It's really that simple. And what the sounds do is match up with the EEG or electroencephalogram patterns that are associated with these kinds of brain activity. The first is called delta wave and that's very low, very slow and can lead you into deep sleep. I have one friend who's used a track for several years. She just puts it on, listens to it and goes to sleep. And the same thing with the meditation and hypnosis tracks, the relaxation and the people who are using the study track which is called beta is a very fast and upbeat track that keeps you alert and helps you think and retain information. Now, binaural beats is interesting because it requires headphones. And so these are actually two different sounds. One sound in the left ear or left track and one sound in the right ear or track. And what the brain does is kind of resolve on the differential between the two frequencies and thus literally synchronizes with the target frequency that you are trying to achieve. The second is much more simple, the isochronic tone, and that is very much like a metronome that musicians use, sort of a tick-tock. The sounds generated by the software, though, do sound like a boop, 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 You'll be able to listen to these as we produce them in the next video. That's when we're going to use the sound generator to create them. So really, this is the basis of creating hypnosis and brainwave MP3s, selecting the kind of first frequency that you want to achieve, and then literally generating each of the tones, a binaural beat and an isochronic tone, then exporting them to your soundtrack that you're working on and adjusting the volume so they're just a little bit out of audible range. They still work even though you can only hear them sort of at the edges of your audio... Is that the right word? I would say oral, A-U-R-A-L, perception. So brainwave music then is a catch-all phrase for binaural beats, and isochronic tones, two kinds of sounds that help synchronize the mind into each of the four categories that we can achieve with these kinds of MP3s. Then again is deep sleep, deep meditation, relaxation, and high focus. So that's all you really need to know in order to get started producing your own brainwave and hypnosis MP3s.